Hi, I'm Brooke Cox. And I'm Ty Butler, and welcome to Hashtag Red Wolf Nation. And for today's show, thanks to the great social media app called Tinder, me and Brooke will be on our very first date. So Brooke, tell me a little about yourself. Well, I'm a junior here at IU East. Um, I like romantic candlelight dinners, long walks on the beach, but since we don't have a beach, long walks at the reservoir right behind the hospital here, but you gotta watch out for the dug poop. <laughs> All right. Um, it's pretty interesting. Uh, for me, I like sports. Okay. I like to hang out with friends a lot. Mm. I like to travel. Um, I don't really like to sit around and be bored too much. Mm. That's never uh, fun. I've only been to the reservoir once to go fishing once. So mm. That'd be you nice know, to go do back you, down there. Do you have any dogs? No, but my roommate has a dog, and so that, I spend a lot of time with it. Yeah, so, so yeah. well, I have two, and they have a okay. dog park there. Yeah. Dang. So, mm -hmm. look, we could, like, all have a big old yeah. date. Now, what kind of dogs do you have? Um, I have a miniature Yorkie and okay. a miniature wiener dog. Probably not going to work out because <laughs> the dog is a boxer that we have at our apartment, and oh. it's pretty crazy. Well, it's okay. They can ride on his back. Okay, yeah. And like a horse. So you're more of a more of a, a cat or a dog? I mean, you do have two dogs, but I just know if you like cats or not. I did have a cat. Um, well, see, what happened one time was I got a kitten, and uh -huh. I, apparently I killed it. I guess I shut it in the door when I was trying to escape. It's pretty messed up, but, I got but okay. But okay, later yeah. on, I got I can, another I can, one. I'll forget about that. I'll, yeah, later yeah. on, I got another one, okay. and she was my baby, and then okay. my brother took her. Well, I'm allergic to cats, so that's like the first try. Well, it's okay. But the it's dogs fine. are yeah. fine. Okay. Yeah, dogs are fine. Yeah. yeah. So, uh, are you from the Richmond area? I am. I did go to Richmond High School. The Red Devils there. Woo woo! Okay. Did you do any sports there? Um, I cheered and played tennis. I did. Okay. I was going to play basketball, but I never did. He asked me every year, and I sh just shot him down. I felt really were you, bad. Were you pretty good at basketball? Or? I was. I played all the way up until middle school. I mean, yeah, I played football all the way up till middle school, but I never went through. <laughs> I wasn't that good, but hey, I played football. I, was, I, just, okay. I mean, I was pretty good if the varsity coach was asking me to play every year. So you played tennis, right, in high school? I played tennis, and I played golf in high school, yeah. Okay, well, and funny story. Um, see, another happened one time is me and Ty have been... We didn't even been, know each other either. We didn't, and, you know, we're at Glenn Miller playing tennis, and I was like, hey, sir, would you like to play a match? I said, yes, ma'am, I and would love to play a tennis I match. beat him. I destroyed him. There's a little Barry Bonds asterisk <laughs> on that match, by the way. Just saying, to clarify. I beat him, took him out. But, he cried. But then the a next week summer, late, oh, but then the next summer, I was riding yeah. my bike around, and you were riding your scooter, and you had your <laughs> you had your tennis racket with you. All of a sudden, I had mine too. We played, and I'm pretty sure I destroyed you on that one. He hit the ball so hard at me that if it hit me, it probably would have went through my body. Like mm. he was trying to kill That's why me. Why I have tennis right here on my? Yeah, well, you don't need to take it. You have a cross on your shirt. You don't well, have tennis. <laughs> True. Are you a pretty religious person? I say that cross on your shirt. Well, you know, is this for is fashion. for fashion, for fashion but... Mm, strike two, sorry. Go oh, ahead, go what? ahead. Are we... Continue. Did I get three strikes? Okay. Well, right, get, Ty. No, there's, there's foul balls, so you can keep going. Is Ty I mean, your real name? Yes. Or is Ty it Tyler? Is my, it is Ty. I was named after Ty Cobb. So basically, your parents were lazy. All right, next question. <laughs> How is your tennis season going? Tennis is going good. Um... Not too bad. Uh, we played against the second best team in our conference first, so that was pretty rough. But uh, I had a really close match, and I felt like uh, if I would have played them probably now or a week later kind of deal, I, c I could have handled it pretty well, oh, yeah. and I probably would have got that win. Mm -hmm. Well, you guys, I, I did beat him, so just want to let that be known that if I beat him, anyone can beat you, him. You want to go to Highland sometime, play some golf? You don't want to play me in golf. I'm pretty good. Mm. My dad played golf. Well, so. you'd have to play in the back tees. You wouldn't be able to tee up in the women's like 20 feet from the hole. You'd okay. Have to All right. Play from the big boys. All right. So putt golf. putt, it is then. Oh, I could beat you in that too. All right, but not our putt putt course here. It's horrible. I've never been. Oh my gosh! Like, if anyone wants to donate some money, donate to our putt putt course in Richmond. It is flat. There is no hills. They have putt putt here. They, I know. You're I shocked. didn't even know. I've been here for three years. Didn't even know that putt. Yeah. Here. Well, we could go if you know if we come down to Evansville. We have a Walter's second date. Walters Golf and Fun. Walters Golf and Fun down to Evansville. They have indoor and outdoor mini putt putt, and there's hills everywhere. All right. So you'd be well, happy. I'm take it as a challenge. No, I no, take putt putt very in serious. I'd beat you in laser tag no, later. I'll bring it on. All that. This is actually one of the best first dates I've been on. I see. Honest, right Look now. at us go. Look at us. Really. All right. So, I know that you play tennis, and then you also manage the basketball team. How's that? Because those guys uh, can be a little mean sometimes. I mean, not really. I mean, I'm good friends with them, but I really don't do 
exactly too much of basketball because, I mean, I played tennis and stuff here, so that's like my main sport. It's more so like my off time, what I do to keep busy because I like basketball and I've made friends with all the guys on the team, so I just do that to kind of hang out with them and just kind of help out. So it really isn't that big of a deal kind of deal. It's more so just helping out where people be, you know, need yeah. some help. Do you get to be with Coach Hester and yell at him like, hurry up and run, you suck? Uh, I don't do any <laughs> of that. Um, if I wanted to, I could, but I'm pretty sure most of the guys wouldn't want to hang out with me afterwards if mm. I was sitting there yelling So you guys stay on the cool, cool side? I'm, 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 on the, be... I'm on the cool side with the, the guys, but yeah. I, I help out whenever I can. Okay. So I have a serious question here. Okay. Would you rather, okay, walk across the Grand Canyon on a tightrope or walk across a pit of alligators on a tightrope? Because oh, either way, you're doomed. No, 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 not at all. Um, easily tightrope over alligators. You're um, gonna. What what people don't know about me? Um, there's a circus that went through Evansville, <laughs> uh, the Ringling Brothers. Brothers or something like that. They came and uh, I showed up an hour early and they did a little balance, like showed people how to do balance stuff on your hand and stuff. And I did that and they also did a little tightrope tightrope uh, exercise to teach you how to walk on a tightrope the easiest. And I didn't even fall once when I kept doing oh. that. So going over the Grand Canyon with the wind. That'd be pretty hard, but if I'm just going over alligator stuff, all I gotta do is keep my eyes forward. And okay. Alligators Did you go to school as a clown? No, I didn't, but my grandma's a clown. Oh, how her was name's, that? Her name's Pockets. Okay. It's fun. She she taught me how to do all these little animals and stuff. I forgot, but I used oh. to I used to be really good. Like wow. you know, I can make you a ladybug, you know, bracelet if you wanted. <laughs> That's it. Not a balloon. No, I could make a good sword or snake. Okay. All right. So, I know that we like we interview people on the show, but mm -hmm. would you rather be the host, or would you like to be behind camera? Because I like being the host. I mean, behind the camera job's not bad, but... Mm -hmm. uh, behind behind the camera's not bad, but I'd really like to be in front of the camera. Yeah, because um, we're hot. I mean, of course. I mean, <laughs> we're dime pieces, you know, I'm just saying. Um, That's right. But, like, I always like being in front of... Like, not... I don't like... Uh, I'm not an attention person. Oh, no. But being in front of the camera is kind of one of those things where it's fun, you know, you're in front of it, you can do whatever you want. And, uh, I mean, yeah, I'd, I'd just really like to be in front of the camera and just... Do something I really like sports-wise because mm, I'm a big sports, sports person. Big time sports yeah, person. Yeah, I don't really care about sports. I played them, but I don't really care. No, I, I spend at least over half of my time on doing sports mm. of some sort. Watching it, playing it, anything like that. Active. Very I like active. that in a guy. Thank you. <laughs> but you're not very active, and I don't know about that. I, I am too. You said you don't like sports or anything. I play them. I just don't like watching them. I like going to the events and watching. Except the Olympics. When the Olympics on, I am like, of course, that's it. I request off work. It is all about the Olympics. I wish I could course, go to the Olympics. Of course, because you'd want me to fly you over there, right? Yeah. In, what, four years, three years from now? The Summer Olympics? you got a long ways to go before I take you overseas. Don't worry, boo. <laughs> It'll be real nice. Nice long flight. <laughs> mm, I'm not really feeling it. Oh, so, so. I, I'm getting shot down right now? Maybe. That's I mean, not even... There's so many things that we don't like together right now. You don't like doing sports, like going... Okay, <laughs> you like playing sports, but you don't like watching them. No. Big no-no, because I love going to Colts games. I love going to Cardinals games. I've never wait, been. Wait, 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 Maybe wait, wait, that's wait, 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 why. Wait. Are you a Reds fan? Are you a Cincinnati Reds yes, fan? Yes, but I've never been. And we'll be right back with Hashtag <laughs> Nation.